Hello everyone, it's me, Big Gay Steve. How you doing? Before we get started, please like and subscribe and hit that bell, the dinner bell, so that every time I release a video, you will get uh, to be on TV and talk about the uh, alien you saw. Uh, but make sure you're uh, in a trailer park. It makes for a better story. Look what I have for you tonight. I know, girl. Well, I failed. I'm back. I'm back on it. I'm back. I'm having Foxy tacos. Okay, they just bring joy to my heart. So, fuck it, girl. We're just gonna get down on it. Okay. Oh, so it's Taco Tuesday. That's another reason why I'm doing uh, Foxy tacos. Uh, and uh, it's November fifth. You know what that is? I bet y'all don't know, do you? That's right. It's my ex boyfriend's birthday today. And uh, since he put me through 10 years of hell, um, I would like to say to him, I still got his number, girl. I'm going to text him later. I'm going to text him. Uh, but I just want to say, uh, Gabriel, um, fuck you. Fuck your birthday. Uh, I hope you live to be 105 years old and suffering greatly in pain every joint in your body for the last 30 years of your life. Um, and I hope that you have... On your deathbed, I hope you have major constipation uh, so bad that when the poop finally comes out of your ass, it ruptures your hemorrhoids and you uh, bleed to death. Okay? So, fuck you. Fuck your birthday. Oh, that's for him. And then, uh, oh, yeah, it's, it's National Erection Day, girl. I mean, Election Day. Uh, so, I uh, hope you participated in the erection, uh, election or the insurrection. What is it, girl? Uh, we'll find out later. Um, so uh, I just wanted to do this taco, uh, I almost called it a challenge, girl. Uh, these tacos symbolize an election. How is that, Steve? Well, uh, when I was exposed to the taco, I didn't want the weenie no more. And um, I even ate a meat tower. And the taco still defeated the meat tower. So bad that I used the leftover meat from the meat tower to make a foxy taco. <clears throat> That's right, girl. I shoved my meat tower right in this foxy taco. Uh, so anyway, um, I guess the message is since this uh, national election, um, if you can't beat them, join them, girl. So if your candidate gets uh, waxed tonight, um, Sometimes it just got me. And it looks, from what I've heard, the taco has a very good chance tonight uh, to defeat the weenie or the meat tower or whatever it is, girl. Cheers. I got some uh, Diet Dr. Pepper that tastes a lot like Diet Dr. Pepper because that's what it is. Uh, I'm going to lay off the whiskey for a while. So anyway, let's get some... Let's get some cream up on these things. My imaginary husband called. He's on his way home. So I'm going to try to wrap this up as quick as I can. But anyway, girl, yeah, it's symbol. It's a, uh, uh, it's a uh, embolism. Uh, uh, what's that? No, not a blocked artery, girl. Um, symbol. Well, it might be. <laughs> I mean, and when we see the results, uh, a lot of people might be falling out with heart attacks. Uh, Anyway, girl. <laughs> uh, what was I saying? Symbolism. Yeah, the taco defeats the meat tower. We'll see. We'll see if that happens. Um, anyway, regardless uh, of who you voted for, um, I'm glad you participated as long as you voted for the person that I voted for. Okay. Um, it's, you know, girl, it's just the way it is. Okay, I'm, I'm figuring it already, girl. See, it, it, this is this is a problem. Anyway, let's dig in, girl. I'm starving. Going in for Foxy Taco. You forgot the thumbnail, girl. Why are you wearing an alien shirt, Steve? Well, the aliens represent um, a big part of the election, too. Uh, because without their technology, uh, if they hadn't come here, uh, 
unwanted and just invaded us uh, and brought their technology from space. Uh, with the, well, that's how we got these good voter machines now that count better. That's what I heard anyway, girl. I heard it on Fox News, so don't quote me on that. Anyway, so here we go. Let's do a let's do a thumbnail real quick. That's right, girl. Uh, let's get into this. Mm. Mm. Girl. These are real simple tacos. Just meat tower with cheese wrapped in Foxy Foxy's lip, uh, lips. No, taco shell. A standard stuff. Taco shell. Mmm. I ain't got no guacamole, no onion, no tomato. Just simple, girl. I didn't feel like going to the stove. Anyway. Oh, girl, I forgot the hot sauce. The hot sauce is supposed to represent the aliens, too. I mean, not the alien, the Mexican. Um, well, it's already Mexican food, Steve. I know, girl, but without hot sauce, that's right. Spray your Mexican vote all over the voting booth. Mmm. That's a lot of hot sauce, Steve. <laughs> oh. Mmm. 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 I was pretty ambi ambi uh, amb ambitious. I got six tacos. I don't know. I don't know if I can eat six, girl. But anyway, girl, whatever happens, uh, it's not the end of the world. I know every candidate, everybody thinks if their candidate loses, it's the end of the world. It's not. Um, girl, Every time there's been a president in office anyway, I never noticed any difference. We still get fucked. <laughs> Have you been fucked any less since the day you were started working and paying taxes? No. Every year, they just start shoving that meat tower deeper and deeper and deeper into your black hole. And I know there's a black hole because the aliens told me it was one. They told me we passed that motherfucker on the way to Earth. Is what they said. Mm. Oh. Mm. Ooh. Just simple sour cream, meat, and cheese. It would be good with some tomato on it, though. I got a tomato down. Mm, mm, mm. 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 Well, it's funny. They've been telling everybody, and so have I. To vote early, vote early, vote early. A lot of people are like, I'll wait till election day. Am I wrong? You don't know what could happen. You could get sick. Your car could break down. A storm can come. The UPS man could show up with his friend and a bottle of wine. <laughs> Never know, girl, what might distract you. Vote early. Nobody I told to vote early voted early. Today, was the first day we had torrential rain falling in Houston. We've had two or three weeks of gorgeous sunshine weather today and decided to rain like a motherfucker. So every time I passed a polling uh, place where they was voting, 
I was rolling the window down and going, ha ha, you stupid motherfucker. <laughs> I'm evil, girl. Mm. Mm. My nice, warm, dry car. <laughs> uh. Mm. I think Winnie Wednesday just might be gone forever, girl. It'll be Taco Tuesday. Which is a shame because with your help, you made Winnie Wednesday a thing. And I just walked out on you, girl. Just like your candidate's going to do for you when they win. What happens when we get what we want? Shit. Yeah. I don't need you no more, girl. I got tacos now. Shit. Sure. Foxy ones at that. Oh. Mm. Mm. I'm glad it finally did stop, though, because uh, my missionary husband's on his way home from work, and uh, I don't know if he's figured out that his BMW doesn't also uh, isn't also a boat, because <laughs> during a hurricane he tried to take the motherfucker water skiing or something and flooded the engine. No, it does not double as a um, Sea Ray ski boat or a Baja or a Chaparral or a cigarette or a Donzi or a Wellcraft or a VIP. Okay, Steve, that's enough boat names. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, oh, mm. y'all participate in the local erections? Actually, the local erection is way, way more important to your lives, really. Everybody gets wrapped up in the presidential erection. <laughs> Election. But your local government, they're the ones that are right next door to you, girl. They're the ones that make changes that really affect you immediately. But nobody ever wants to pay attention to them. I've said it before. I've said it again. I'll say it again. We got to stop electing people to office and then turning them loose like a bunch of pit bulls, just unlatching their leash and say, okay, go play. And then we go in the house and have a margarita and forget, forget about what they're doing out there. No, you vote for somebody, pay attention to what they're doing. Are they doing what they said they were going to do? Are they fucking up? If they're fucking up, call them, write them a letter. That's one thing in America we've gotten really bad about. We just don't force off politicians to behave. And that's why they're all crooks. That's why they all get elected. And uh, the job they're doing, and they're making 30000 a year. The city of Houston's full of it, full of corruption. They're, they're making 30000 a year. They work there 20 years. They retire. They're a multimillionaire. Now, how does that happen? <laughs> Got to start paying attention, bro. We can't just be sticking our heads in the sand. Now pay attention, girl. So whoever you voted for, pay, hold, hold their feet to the fire. Ask yourself, are they doing what they said they were going to do? And if not, write them a fucking letter, girl.
So if they get in there and fuck everything up, I don't know. I guess we all get the government. We deserve the government we vote for. So. I'm just bullshit. I don't do none of that myself either. Fuck them. Girl, I just vote for them if they're hot. <laughs> Which this election was very difficult. Because <sighs> ain't none of them cute. And one of them's a female. But the taco started to... I was on the fence, girl. I really was. Mm. I knew there was a reason I didn't put sour cream on these other two. I was probably going to fill up before I could eat them. Mm. Or run out of shit to talk about. <laughs> Let's talk about my ex. Let's come back to him. Gabriel Flores. Mm -hmm. Um, you are an evil, hateful, vindictive bitch to me. For 10 years. And now look what happened. I'm an evil. Hateful. Vindictive. Bitch. So like I said. Fuck you. Fuck your birthday. And uh, I hope you have. I hope your hemorrhoids. Rupture. And you bleed to death. Uh, at a, about 105 years old. Steve, that's awful. You didn't live with him, girl. That bitch was... <laughs> Shit. Hateful. <sighs> but he had a dick like two of these cans stacked on top of each other. I guess that's what kept me... I don't know. Everybody asked me, why did you stay with him? He wasn't that good looking. He had bow legs. Probably because they was wrapped around somebody all the time. Big fucking hoe. Girl, he had a He had a meat tower. I miss the meat tower. I don't know why it doesn't do nothing for me anymore. <laughs> He's gonna put some more cream in. He's gonna figure this dog out. And meat towers will make you do crazy shit, girl. Make you waste 10 years of your life. I have a feeling these tacos will, too. Some of y'all's probably had... Some of y'all out there probably had your life ruined by some tacos, haven't you, girl? Stay with that taco way too long. Like, I don't know why I keep hanging around this taco. It's too loose now. Doesn't smell good anymore. I can't leave it, girl. I know, I know, I know. Sometimes you, you just get beat down, girl. Mm. I think I'll let you go there, girl. I'm going to uh, go take a shit. Um, and then I knew there was something missing. Go take a shit. And then I'm going to uh, kick back and uh, 
watch the presidential uh, insurrection uh, erection, election unfold before my uh, very thighs, eyes. So I love you guys. Give me a kiss. Other side. I'll see you on the next mukbang, girl, in case World War Three happens. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see, girl. Uh, I'm just bullshitting. Ain't nothing going to happen. None. You, just, you can go to work tomorrow if you got a job. Ugh. But you're going to wake up. The same shit's going to happen. You're going to go to work. You're going to same assholes at work. Same fucking. Every, it's just going to be the same. And you're going to go. I things are going to be different. Bitch, please. Just go eat some tacos. It'll all be good. Believe me. All right. I love you guys. Good night. Happy uh, 2024 election night.